Hi, my name is Krista Voss and I'm the author of Smoke River, which comes out in May 2014. Smoke River takes place in a small town. This town is on the border of a large reserve and there's a piece of land between the town and the reserve that nobody's quite sure who it belongs to, but it's been part of the reserve for a very long time. Except when a couple purchase it, purchases it from the town and they begin to develop a townhouse and golf course a development on this piece of land. What happens is two very strong women from the reserve decide to protest this and they barricade the development. So what unfolds over really the course of a summer, as long as it takes to plant a tobacco crop and harvest it, is a whole bunch of events that spiral outwards from this act of reclamation and how it affects people on both sides of the land dispute. So the, the book is written from the points of view of the couple who are developing it and their children. In addition to that, it is written from the points of view of the two women who are protesting um, the, the uh, development and their niece and her father. Two other people are involved. One is a cigarette manufacturer and the other is a tobacco farmer. And both of them are drawn into the story by the land itself, their shared history with that piece of land, and also just complications of the heart and memory and identity. So at its heart, Smoke River looks at a land conflict from the points of view of all the people that are involved with it. And at a larger level, it really looks at how so many other things um, be can become pieces of territory that we can um, dispute. Uh, the heart, notions of justice, of law, even spaces within our own homes, and history and identity. Um, and, uh, and yeah, and that's really the story of Smoke River. Thank you.